Hi everyone, welcome to our channel Homecast TV. Today we are going to be talking on sore throat, the causes, symptoms and how to cure sore throat with our natural homemade products or stuff around the home. Please stay tuned and watch this video to the end and you are going to help somebody with the tips we are going to be discussing in this video. So the multi-million dollar question is, what is sore throat? Sore throat refers to pain, itchiness or irritation of the throat. It may result in inflammation around the neck which may result also in disturbances or pain or on ease around the neck. These may in turn prevent you from having a good night's sleep. There are basically three types of sore throat which are classified based on the part of the throat they affect. The first on our list is pharyngitis. These are sore throats that affect the area right behind the mouth. The second is tonsillitis. Tonsillitis are sore throats that are swollen and showing redness of the tonsils, the soft tissue that is in the back of the mouth. And the third is laryngitis. Laryngitis is swelling and redness of the voice box or the larynx. Sore throat is caused by viral infections and bacteria. Viruses cause about 90% of sore throats. For example, mums, an infection that causes swelling of the salivary glands in the neck. Other minor causes of sore throat are we have the strep throat. Strep throat is caused by bacterial infections which may also result in sore throat. Strep throat is an infection of the throat and the tonsil caused by group A streptococcus bacteria. Strep throat causes nearly 40% of sore throat cases in children. Dry air. Dry air can suck moisture from the mouth and the throat and leave them feeling dry and scratchy. The air is almost likely dry in the winter months when the heater is running. Smoke, chemicals and other irritants. Many different chemicals and other substances in the environment irritate the throat including cigarette and tobacco smoke, air pollution, cleaning products and other chemicals. After September 11, more than 62% of responding firefighters reported frequent sore throats. Only 3.2% had had sore throat before World Trade disaster. Also, we also have injuries. Any injury such as a hit or a cut to the neck can cause pain in the throat. Similarly, getting a piece of stock food in your throat can also irritate it. Also, repeated usage of the vocal cords can strain the vocal cords and the muscles in the throat. You can get a sore throat after healing, talking loudly or singing for a long period of time. Sore throats are common complaints among fitness instructors and teachers who often have to hear how can one tell when he or she is suffering from sore throat. Throat pain is the primary symptom of a sore throat followed by headaches or neck inflammations. It may get worse when you try to swallow and you may have difficulty swallowing food and liquids. Okay, okay. Hello? What's the, so what's the way out? To go see the doctor? Of course you should consult the doctor if it's already in the chronic stages. But before you do that, try these 12 killers of sorrow that are found around your home. The first killer in our list today is honey. Honey, taken on its own, is a common household remedy for sore throat. It was discovered that honey was even more effective at taming night coughs than common cough supplements. Other research is also conducted shows that honey is an effective honeyler, which means it may help speed healing for sore throat. So get your bottle of honey if you don't yet have one. You may also mix honey with your tea before taking and a slice of lemon or lime. It works like magic. Number two, 
The second killer on our list is salt water. Gangling with warm salt water can help soothe a sore throat and break down secretions. It is also known to help to kill bacteria in the throat. Make a salt water solution with a half teaspoon of salt in a full glass of warm water. Gargle it to help reduce swelling and keep the throat clean. This should be done every three hours or so for at least seven days. Number three. The third killer on the list today is chamomile tea. Chamomile tea is naturally soothing. It has long been used for medicinal purposes like soothing a sore throat. It is often used for its anti-inflammatory, antioxidant and astringent properties. Studies have shown that inhaling chamomile steam can help relieve symptoms of a cold, including a sore throat. Drinking chamomile tea can offer the same benefit. It can also stimulate the immune system to help your body fight off the infection that caused your sore throat in the first place. And when you get your tea, boil to 100 degrees Celsius, allow to chill, then drink while it's still warm. Two to three times a day for seven days will do. So get your chamomile tea in the closest supermarket. Number four. The fourth killer for today is peppermint. Peppermint is known for its ability to refresh in breath. Violated peppermint oil sprays may also relieve sore throat. Peppermint contains menthol, which helps thin mucus and calm sore throats and cough. Peppermint also has anti-inflammatory, antibacterial and antiviral properties, which may encourage healing. A little advice, never use peppermint without essential oils. Always mix your peppermint with any essential oil such as olive oil, sweet almond oil or softened coconut oil. Never ingest essential oils. The fifth on our list today is baking soda gurgle. While the salt water gurgle is more commonly used, Baking soda gurgle mixed with salt water can help relieve the sore throat as well. Gargling this solution can kill bacteria and prevent the growth of yeast and fungi. Experts recommend gargling and gently switching a combination of a cup of warm water, a quarter teaspoon of baking soda, and half the same quantity of salt. They recommend using and rinsing every three hours as needed. Number six on our list is the fenugreek. The fenugreek has many health benefits. It also has many forms. You can eat fenugreek seeds. You can use the topical oil or drink the fenugreek tea. The fenugreek tea is a natural remedy for sore throat. Research demonstrates the healing powers of fenugreek. It can relieve pain and kill bacteria that cause irritation or inflammation. Fenugreek is also an effective antifugal medicine. The number seven on our list today is the marshmallow root. The marshmallow root contains a musky like substance that coats and soothes a sore throat. Simply add some of the dry root to a cup of boiling water to make tea. Sipping the tea two or three times a day may help ease throat pain. People with diabetes should talk to a to a doctor before taking marshmallow roots. Some animal research shows it may cause a drop in blood sugar level. On the number 8 spot, we have the lycoris root. Lycoris root has long been used to treat sore throats. Recent research shows it's effective when mixed with water to create a solution for gargling. However, pregnant and breastfeeding women should avoid this remedy. The ninth killer on our list is the strip PM. Like the marshmallow root, slippery M has a musky-like substance in it. When mixed with water, it forms a silk gel that coats and suits the throat. To use this, pour boiling water over a powdered bag, stir and drink. You may also find that slippery M lozenges help. Slippery M is a traditional remedy for sore throat. 
but more research is needed. According to the U.S. National Library of Medicine, it may decrease the absorption of other medications. The tenth killer is the apple cider vinegar. The apple cider vinegar, ACV, has many natural antibacterial uses. Numerous studies show its antimicrobial effects in fighting infections. Because of its acidic nature, it can be used to help break down mucus in the throat and stop bacteria from spreading. If you sense a sore throat coming on, try diluting 1 to 2 teaspoons of ACV in 1 cup of warm water and gargle with it. Then take a small sip of the mixture and repeat the whole process one to two times per hour. Make sure to drink lots of water between the gargling sections. There are many different ways of using ACV to treat sore throat depending on the severity of the illness and also on your body sensitivity to vinegar. It, it is best to consult your doctor or health practitioner before you use this remedy. Number 11 on a killing list is garlic. Garlic also has natural antibacterial properties. It contains acylene, an organic sulfur compound known for its ability to fight off infections. Sources have shown that taking a garlic supplement on a regular basis can help prevent the common cold virus. Adding fresh garlic to your diet is also a way of gaining its antimicrobial properties. Your grandmother might have told you to suck on a clove of garlic to soothe a sore throat because garlic has many healing actions. You might try this, though you may want to brush your teeth after this to protect your teeth from enzymes and improve your breath. The twelfth on the list is cayenne pepper. Cayenne pepper or hot sauce cayenne is often used as a pun reliever. Cayenne pepper contains capsaicin, a natural compound known for blocking pain receptors. Although not scientifically proven, ingesting cayenne mixed with warm water and honey can help with pain relief for sore throat. Remember that an initial burning sensation is common. Cayenne should not be taken if you have open sauce in your mouth. Start with just a few drops of hot sauce or light sprinkling of cayenne as both can be very hot. Hope you have learned something watching this video so far. But before you go, there is a bonus for you. Eat a lot of ginger with its related product every time you are presented with an opportunity to do so because it's a deadly destroyer of sore throat. Thanks for watching. If you have learned something, please subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below to be the first to get subsequent releases through our channel. And if you're on phone or on tablet, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell as well and help us share with your friends and family. We love you, Home Kiosk TV.